At the Venice event, uh, at the Venice Film Festival, uh, the five nominees for the Lux Prize were selected. And uh, what is important for the movies who want to take part in this wonderful uh, uh, competition is that they have to tell European stories, stories about our values, stories that are told and listened to in Europe. I think the European cinema is important. It's a piece of our culture. It's a piece uh, of uh, yeah, identity of people and it's a, a very important part of our cultural experience. Uh, to go to a cinema is always an experience you share with other people. It's not just sit, sitting on the sofa watching a movie, it's more than that. And that is what we want to foster. We want to uh, bring forward the European uh, cinema landscape and the European film with this uh, prize. So uh, what we do for the movies uh, when they are part of the selection panel is that we um, subtitle them so that everyone in Europe can uh, take part uh, in this, in this uh, selection. And what is very important also, that everyone is also able to vote for a movie and to make their own choice. I think that's a, a good thing also to remind people uh, that the European elections will take place on the 9th of June. Uh, I think that's very, very important also to uh, have this uh, other way of reaching out to people with European values and what Europe is standing for via this selection and via the, uh, the Lux Prize. And I think the Lux Prize is also something um, that uh, gives possibilities to discuss about our European values and also about the European Union. What people can do from the 1st of September, also go to screenings organized by the parliaments, go to commercial screening, screenings, uh, the films are also in the cinemas during the next month, but if you watch it by a uh, parliament screening or by a commercial screening, you always can vote for the movies on the platform and uh, rate each and every movie.